This is good stuff. Okay, I don't know about you guys, but uh, Halloween just passed, and my Facebook page was literally inundated with shit like this. Okay, so I started to notice this little trend going on of a bunch of people literally outside of one's culture suddenly posting all these like, let's be woke people, this is what the brown people really want us to do type of articles all over the fucking place. Hell, it's become goddamn gospel. So I'm gonna tell you guys, this shit needs to stop. I'll give you the example that I often bring up, which is because I am Latin. I fucking hate the word Latin X. And it's not because of transphobia, because we don't want a gender neutral word in an obviously gendered language. No, it has to do with the fact that this word is literally unpronounceable in the Spanish language. Seriously, you cannot say it. So how the fuck are you supposed to feel when the language you speak cannot say the word you want to be identified as? There's a bit of a problem there. On top of that, the letter X I don't know about you, but when I was in school and I'd get a paperback littered in X's, I wasn't exactly jumping for joy because X is the fucking symbol for incorrect. And I do not want to be associated as incorrect. Newsflash, people, this word has a lot of fucking divisiveness within our community. And so suddenly sticking this shit all over Facebook and saying, this is what we want to be called and this is what the Latin X community wants is a lot of horse shit and needs to fucking stop. But that is just the example I give to myself. But the misinformation these people fucking give as to why you should or shouldn't do something is, is astronomical. Do you ever get this? You know, you shouldn't wear a kimono because a kimono is like what geishas wear and geishas are like, um, like priestesses in Japan and they're very sacred. And no, they're not prostitutes. That's only something white people invented. So, you know, kimonos are just like super special and, and you can't wear them because you don't understand how culturally important they are. This is bullshit. What, what a lot of misinformation are we getting now? And the cherry on the goddamn condescension fucking Sunday. When you tell these people, no, actually, you're wrong. Um, I, I don't like that word. Oh, and I don't mind if, you know, someone wants to, you know, dance salsa music and, 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 and do things like Day of the Dead, which also Colombians celebrate, by the way. These assholes will turn to you and then say, well, it looks like I care more about your culture than you do. Come pinga, motherfuckers. Stop this. Stop using a different culture and saying how we want to be treated according to, you know, some fucking random asshole you met probably born in goddamn Orange County who explained, you know, why they feel this way and then blanket stated as that that's what we all want to be without fucking taking into account that there's fucking possibly the majority, I would say, of us that don't like this shit, that we actually like spreading our culture and sharing it and we don't give half a fuck what you're doing. And in fact, we hate that you think we all are the same fucking monolith of ideas. Shitheads, stop it. We are not fucking brown people ass kissing points that you know you need to accumulate to show how fucking awesome you are. Well, if you like my video, give it a like or a subscribe, or you could bitch in the comments about how wrong I am and how ugly I look and why don't I wear makeup. So yeah, that's it. I have a Patreon that no one ever goes to, but it's still there. Find me on Facebook, follow me on the Twitters, and every other fucking social media crap if you want to see random photos of me and my dog or me eating cupcakes or something ridiculous like that. Okay, that's enough for now. Peace out, motherfuckers.